Forex traders, it is time for some Forex. Time to make some money and time to make some rituals. Now, guys, if you're just joining me for the first time, my name is Dapo Willis. I am your favorite, favorite Forex trader. And, guys, you know what we're going to be going to doing today? We're going to be talking about how to make some cool cash on the Forex market. So, if you want to make money this week, don't go anywhere. Sit your ass down. I'm going to talk about some charts and how to potentially what? Put some money in your bank account. Now, guys, as you know from the way the video kicked off, um, this is going to be obviously another episode of Trader Talk whereby I jump into my charts, I go behind the scenes, and I break down my chart to look out for potential trading opportunities that can ultimately what put money in my account, first of all. <laughs> guys, you guys know I, I, trade, I trade a significant amount of money for some very wealthy people. So I'm going to be going into my charts and I'm going to be coming up with some very top analysis that you guys can use to help yourself put some money in your bank account. I'm going to be doing the same thing as well. Guys, I'm sure you guys can tell I'm very, 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 very excited. I'm very excited because after the most successful launch ever when it comes to prop firms, Willis Capital, that belongs to all of us. Yes, Willis Capital is a prop firm built by traders for traders. We've gone ahead to launch it and you guys have already started purchasing your accounts. But what is particularly making me very, very happy and excited is the amount of pass rates. Guys, it is so easy to pass a Willis Capital trading account, uh, prop, Willis Capital prop account, because all you need to do is do five percent. Five percent people are up to phase two. People have started getting funny. As a matter of fact, we have live traders who've made money and have issued their withdrawals and are gonna get paid out tomorrow morning, which is Monday morning. And apart from all of that, what is actually 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 making me excited is all the testimonials. So. I feel like for the first time in the history of Forex, um, we've been able to bridge the gap. We've been able to finally help, you know, put the power of Forex back in the hands of the traders, right? Because for the first time in Forex, we're actually merging education and funding. Yes. So what most traders are doing now after they purchase the prop account, if you haven't done that, I suggest you do that. The link is going to be in the description down below. So what traders are doing now, they are purchasing Willis Capital prop accounts and they are coming to my YouTube channel and they are watching Trader Talk because on, on here, what I'm pretty much doing is I'm giving you guys trades that are actually going to work out because as you guys know, I use the top-down analysis and I'm right 9 out of 10 times. To think about it, they're buying prop account. They're just coming here to watch and look out for the best trading opportunities, which I always present to you guys. And they're just placing the trades. So I'm literally giving you guys money and I'm giving you guys trades. Money plus trades equals what? Riches, guys. It has never been done anywhere. And aside from that as well, I'm seeing all the certificates coming. The testimonials are mad. My telegram is going crazy. People are like, Sadaps, thank you for making the challenge as easy as possible. Because I know, before we designed the whole system, I told my team, I said, listen, most prop firms out there want people to fail the challenges. Okay? So we need to make this as straightforward and as simplified as possible. Two, we need to ensure that we're actually funding the traders with live money. These two things that we've done, and then obviously we added education as well. I said, if we are able to do these three things right, we'll have more successful traders on our platform. And don't forget, it is in the best interest of for Willis Capital to have successful traders because when you guys make money in the live trading round, we make money as well. It's a 70-30 split. You guys keep 70%, we keep 30%, right? So... I'm really excited because imagine a product that we built with all this vision. The vision was to put the power back in the hands of the traders. The vision was to make you guys more money. He's actually playing. Um, I'm seeing all the certificates going on. I'm seeing all the hedge fund managers Willis Capital is creating. So guys, I'm very, very proud. Now guys, if you want to be part of this movement, once again, ensure to click the link down below or around here. Grab yourself a Willis Capital account. I suggest you get between the 25k to 50 k account simple grab one of them i'm about to jump into my screen now i'm going to show you guys some trades all you need to do is grab the account watch the trades that i'm going to be placing on i'm going to be analyzing wait for the trades to manifest place the trades you pass your challenges watch my analysis again and you go trade to the live round click your withdrawal and you're good if you're making 20 30 percent on a 50k account that's what 10 grand for you 
It's 10,000 US dollars. I don't care what part of the world you are in. The 10 grand is a lot of money. So guys, once again, I'm really excited and it's always a pleasure to be hanging out with you guys. Now, if you know you want to make this year the best trading year of your life, click just type down below success at willis capital say success at will i want to see people commenting down below success at willis capital do that right now and i prophesy to everybody who's watching this you're gonna make money on the willis capital platform now guys enough of all of this let's jump into why we're here let's talk charts let's talk money and let's talk withdrawals ladies and gentlemen it's time for some trading and let's go all right, beautiful people, it's time to jump into my screen. It's time to make some money. Cha -cha -cha -ching. <laughs> Guys, anytime I see the Forex channel, I'm always so excited. I'm always so happy because this is like, this is my bread and butter, man. This is where, this is where, this is what, what it all comes down to. Um, your ability to understand price action and your ability to consistently extract pips and profit from the market now guys before i jump into all of this um if you haven't subscribed to the youtube channel i, I encourage you to do so just tap the button right there but most importantly please i'm about to drop some fire analysis i'm about to drop some trading opportunities don't waste it ensure to grab yourself a willis capital proper account so that you can use this to make some money okay there's no point just allowing these trades go by and you haven't used the opportunity to make yourself money like i said to you guys it is so easy to pass these challenges phase one is five percent okay and i think phase two is probably like seven percent or so it's insignificant i think it's about five percent as well so literally all you need is two two winning trades and then you're in straight to your live funding stage so if you haven't grabbed your willis capital proper account the link is going to be in the description as always ensure to what to grab it okay so yeah back to the chart so um i was a bit confused as to what which one i wanted to speak on first usually i start off with AUD USD, but i think i've been doing that a bit too much i am currently in a trade i've been in a trade since i think uh, uh probably around last week of january slash first first week of february um which is the euro dollar um so like i said to you guys the last time we had trader talk if you remember correctly i'm just going to quickly start over from the monthly time frame so that we can have a fair idea of what exactly what the hell is going on with euro usd um so euro usd is pretty much a very straightforward scenario on the monthly time frame as you can see everything is drafting and dragging you know taking this time to head to the downside we came down here we popped all the way back to the upside and we've just pretty much um been in stock in this range now the reason for this range you see for every for every impulse leg and the, for every impulse leg we have a pullback okay anytime we have a significant amount of pips pour out like this and we have a pullback we must have what they call a resultant consolidation period. So if this market was trading for, let's say, I don't know, about, about a year. Best believe the range might last a year. <laughs> don't be scared. There's always ways to trade the market. But it's very important that you guys know these things. Like I keep saying to you guys, Willis Capital traders, you're managing Willis Capital money. So these things are very important for you guys to know. For every time we trend for a period of time, we must always come and consolidate. So what this does for you, what this knowledge does for you is it helps prepare your mind so that you're not thinking, oh, it's going to be a trend. Oh, you're going to make 10,000 pips. Oh, no, no. Nah. Once we get into a range, the dynamics are different. And once you understand that the dynamics are different, then you can position and prepare your mind accordingly now we're currently in this nasty range so the way i'm going to approach this range will be completely different from when we if if we were in a trading market right so sorry guys i have a bit of a flu <laughs> um so yeah i'm going to look at this a bit differently so the monthly has told me all he needs to tell me two things are going on um i was expecting euro usd to collapse all the way back down here to about parity but this key level as i teach you guys on the forex mastery program this key level has held this market about here and that's not happening anytime soon so what do we do in this kind of situation um i was expecting us to drop lower we had a bullish engulfing candle kind of around here the market just went into a nasty range so i'm gonna bring out my ranging tactics my ranging hat okay um I then look at the range for what it is. So what exactly is going on in the range? So you come on the weekly time frame to look out for if there are any kind if there are any chart patterns forming within the range. You realize that chart patterns usually 
what usually happens in the, in a in a range how do we determine what direction and what a range is going to blow out to so don't forget this is a range for example this is the top of the range this is the bottom of the range how do we know which direction this market is going to blow out into you need to come on the weekly time frame forex mastery students you know this um once again for those of you guys who have already grabbed the prop account and would like to get some education and don't know how to get some education ensure to grab the forex mastery program the link is going to be in the description as always it will teach you how to do all of this now this is the top of the range this is the bottom of the range anytime we go into a range come to a weekly time frame and then identify what exactly is going on if you're a forex mastery student straight off the bat you can tell that this is a left shoulder this is a head and this is a right shoulder and this is the neckline of this market so from what i can see price action wise this market is forming a bearish head and shoulder pattern meaning that if we need we do break lower to this blue bar and we break lower than this blue bar we're gonna bleed all the way to the downside um so i have monthly telling me that this market is flowing south i have a weekly time frame pretty much putting in all the characteristics of a of uh, a bearish head and shoulder pattern so what's going to happen now is ideally i'm expecting this market to roll over to this blue zone so i came on the daily time frame to look exactly so to zoom in so now i'm thinking bearish 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 so i did have uh, an inner trend line that was broken somewhere about here and then as you know we've tapped the top of the pretty pretty much the right shoulder and went heading all the way back to the neckline um what's going to happen we're definitely going to bleed all the way to the blue the blue zone about here my sell positions are somewhere around here my stop losses go above here okay so i'm currently sat on my hands and i'm waiting for euro usd to roll over um however we've we've we've, we've encountered some some issues here um this black bar that i've put here um obviously the market this is pretty this was pretty much um a supply zone at some point and obviously played out uh sometime in the future which was somewhere about here so the market spun around here so right now as we speak this level right here is holding this market so what i'm going to simply do is i'm going to use my yellow zone to identify to mark this level out about here so the reason why euro usd is not collapsing properly is because of this yellow bar um we're clearly having difficulties breaking this yellow bar so what i've done um, is I've moved my stop losses, which were above here, all the way down to my entries, which is somewhere around this black bar somewhere here. And I'm going to be obviously monitoring this market because the market is not a trending market. You can't always expect the market to just go just because you say go. Here we go. <laughs> trending markets don't work. Um, ranging markets don't work like that, ladies and gentlemen. They, they, they make crazy, right? It's fucking crazy shit, man. <laughs> they don't work like that. So, you always have to ensure that you are prepared and ready to adjust your trades and move your stop losses accordingly. Uh, my stop losses are not just going to be at break even, but they're going to be at least 25 pips past break even, just in case we have a push all the way to the upside. Now, this is my contingency plan. So, in the event that things do play out, which I hope they do and which they most likely should, um, we should definitely roll over down to this blue zone. So, I'm going to be monitoring this area somewhere around here. Uh, I think Willis Capital, what actually made most Willis Capital traders pass their phase one and phase two to get funded was actually the Euro US dollar trade because I did the analysis on my previous trader talk video and it was so simple straightforward they just click sell stop losses here and boom they've already made five percent but i'm expecting and hopeful that we do indeed a roll over further to the downside but it's looking <sighs> we'll see we gotta be hopeful gotta be hopeful hopeful and he'll make a way i know it ain't easy it ain't easy man forex ain't easy you know, so it's constantly testing you and constantly trying to find out if you're the guy. So that's Euro USD in a nutshell, guys. Um, nothing much really going on here. Once we clear down here and I start seeing some red candles, I will definitely be adding to my sell position. Overall target for now is 1.05500, which obviously is between here and here. So this is pretty much the demand zone for Euro USD. Once we come in here, I will be closing a portion of my trade and hopefully we break here and then roll over to the downside so it's a lot of potentialities for the euro okay 
it's a lot of potentialities for the euro um i hope we do indeed continue bleeding if we don't continue bleeding um we might want to attack this yellow zone about here again and i hope not so let's see something All right, cool. So it's possible that we're coming in for the third touch of the trend line, which is about here. So, ladies and gentlemen, let's hope that this trend line holds. If this trend line holds, um, we will definitely be seen further downside. If not, um, we will be forced to close out our trades a bit prematurely because, hey, this is forex, and like I said, we always have to be prepared. We always have to be ready. I'm not the kind of forex that will come on here and tell you, oh, I have this magical strategy. I have this secret sauce, and now this is what it takes to be successful. This is it, okay? And it's not difficult. It's not rocket science. You just have to open your eyes and be prepared. Be willing to walk away with 3%, 5%. If you're lucky, 10 12 15%. But be willing to walk away with whatever the market has to give you. So I'll be monitoring the euro dollar just to see what exactly is going on. And then I'll be revisiting another episode of Trader Talk, I think, next weekend. Um, so yeah, let's give it a week and see what happens. So over, done with the euro dollar. Let's go over to some more interesting stuff, which is the S and P 500, which I have been making so much money from. I have made so much money from the S and P 500. It is, it is, it is, it is, it is, it is. It should be illegal. The amount of money I've made from, I've been holding my S and P 500 trade since here. Since here, when I called it. Yes, you guys know. Think I'm lying? Scroll back to my previous trader talk videos. You know I don't chat shit, and you know this is my strategy. This is my style. Will is zone bounce. I told you guys first level target for S and P 500 4,800 basis points. We've cleared that. I said if we clear here, we're coming to 5,200. As you can see, we're somewhere in the middle of that. I've been holding this since here since 4,200. We're literally approaching for almost 5k. So I'm looking at a potential about. Hold on. Yes, a potential 800 pip move to the upside. I took out about 25% of my position here. I moved stop losses to break even. So I'm coasting on S&P 500 and I'm chilling. Now, guys, this brings me back to what I always preach to you guys. It's not about how many trades you place. It's all about the quality of the damn trades you're placing. Quality over what? Quantity. You see, I've placed one S&P 500 trade um, and it's pretty much me making me money all the way to the upside. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to scale over to the daily time frame and look out for potential consolidations. As you can see, I can see a somewhat of a double top forming here. Um, so I'm going to be one more actually. Hold on. <clears throat> Yeah, that's correct. There's no need to do anything. I was overthinking something. So from what I can see here, I would have jumped in on a potential buy trade after this consolidation, but we were too close to the resistance zone somewhere out here. So I allowed the market go. I can see a double top forming somewhere around here. I can almost tell that the S&P 500 wants to pull back somewhat. Um, why? Because as I keep telling you guys, the market doesn't really like to move in a linear fashion. You know, this is too linear. So the market is too straight. So I'll be waiting for a potential consolidation on the S&P 500 to potentially add more positions to my position. As you can see, we've formed the high. We've, we've had this. This is a high. This is a low. This is a high. This is a higher high. Take that again. High, low, higher high, higher low. And then this is failing to make a higher high. So anytime there's a break of, uh, not, not structure, but break of flow when it comes to a trend, the market usually wants to go into a consolidation period. So I'll be waiting for, you see, the trading opportunities are when the market consolidates within a trending market. So I'm going to wait for this to probably pull back. Ideally, we'll probably pull back into the demand zone either here or here, see, I'm making trading as simple as possible. It's just simple, bro. It's just simple, bro. Simple, my G. Pull back. Let me see what's happening. Let it dance around a bit. It will dance around like this. Can you see? It will dance around like this. Dance around. You open your eyes. You see, okay, this market is dancing around. And you look for trading opportunities. I would advise the counter trend uh, trading opportunity. 
uh, counter trend line trading strategy that I teach on the Forex Mastery Program. Guys, if you haven't grabbed the Forex Mastery Program, the link is going to be around here or in the description as always. Or if you don't find it, check my previous videos. Get it. All these things will come easy to you so that you can easily pass your Forex, uh, your Willis Capital Prop from challenges. So this is S&P founder, ladies and gentlemen. I'm waiting for a potential pullback for a setup to happen so that I can jump in and stack up and add to my position. Overall target is 5,200 basis points, and that's final for S&P 500. Now, let's go over to BTC, something a bit more interesting. BTC is doing BTC things, and I'm very happy. Um, I think the, the bullish revolution is back, officially back. From what I can see, I see no reason why BTC isn't clear. Let's go over to the monthly time frame to see where exactly the, the supply zone is. The supply zone is looking very clear at $61,500 per coin. I see no reason why BT, BTC is clear, guys. BTC, what BTC, T, what Lee, it is clear to the upside. Okay, we're clear to 61k so what this simply means to me is i have space to trade i'm happy so i'm going to be like just like the s p fund i'm going to be waiting for a potential consolidation around here now i can move to a far time frame and then look for potential pullbacks okay i'm looking for potential btc pullbacks um ideally btc is at least on another 48k to 61k so you're looking at about maybe 1400 pips btc is going to stack up for us so BTC is clear, guys. Nothing is in its way. We're all the way to the upside. So like with most pairs as we speak, the market is kind of like still in trend. I don't like to buy. I don't like to trade when it's still in trend because you can, for example, if we bought here now, the market pull back, we get stopped out and then it goes in our direction. That's what most traders always complain about. Oh, I jumped into the trade. I bought the market, but you still stopped me out and then went in my direction. That's because you probably placed the trade too early. So what is happening now is I need to exercise some patience. Yes, I need to wait. I need consolidations. I need the market to come and play around, pull back into here, into some of these demand zones. And then I can obviously start looking for counter trend line moves. And then obviously stop losses must come below here. And then I can start buying for another 1,400 pip to the upside. So yeah, and I'm going to be back tweeting again about the markets. Um, yeah, it's, it's pretty much it's pretty much amazing. I love Forex. I love Forex because Forex is sweet when you know what you're doing, when you know what the market's going to do next. Uh, I was going to go over AUD USD um, quite briefly, but AUD USD is not really worth my time right now. Okay, what's going on AUD USD? Let's have a look. Let's have a look, gents, ladies, and gents. It's yours truly, that Paul Willis. So there's some evil spirit that is disturbing AUD USD as we speak. It's a little bit of an evil spirit. But from what I can see, AUD USD is trading below everything it needs to trade below. It's trading below this. Let me show you. This trend line dates back a long time. This trend line dates back from the top in February, late 2020, early 2021. You can tell this is simple and straightforward. Bam, Treadline has always slapped it down. And this looks like it's slapping it down even further. So, and this is a bearish engulfing last month, which was January close as a bearish engulfing candle, which invalidates the previous bullish engulfing candle in November. So we look like we're pointing downwards. The trend is pointing downwards. I don't see any reason why we shouldn't drop downwards. But right now, we just have some some evil spirits. <laughs> Some evil spirits that are just trying to ensure that this doesn't drop, but mm, provided we stay below this bar, let me make it easy for you guys, delete some stuff and make the chart easy for you guys to see. Uh, where are my bars now? Provided we stay below this zone, oh, this is going to be nice, so. AUDUSD might just be dropping, provided we stay below this bar and we start to see, you start to see some bearish signals. Yeah, provided we stay below this yellow bar, um, I see no reason why AUDUSD shouldn't drop. So I'm going to be waiting. Um, actually, sometime during the week, I'm going to be looking for potential selling opportunities on AUDUSD. Now that I've opened the charts, 
I see, I see no reason why not, to be honest. I see no honest reason why not at this point. So what is actually stopping AUD USD from dropping at the moment? I know there's an internal trend line that's just been an absolute prick, which is this one. Can you guys see? This guy is touching. It's like when you have a toothache and there's that piece of meat or food that's just in your tooth it's annoying you it's what this tread line is so <clears throat> at the end of the day may the best man win <laughs> may the best man win so that's exactly what's happening so he doesn't know if he wants to push it higher or not so i'm gonna have to wait to see i'm gonna need AUD USD to somewhat come and at least try to prove us prove to us so i need direction i need clarity okay come on i'm not gonna be selling here hell no hell no i'm gonna wait this guy needs to roll over i'm expecting for the downside if this level holds and we start to roll over all i need is a bearish engulfing candle come down here close somewhere around here i'm jumping in for the sales mate i'm jumping in for the sales mate or this is what i also might need to see i might need to see something like this I might need to see something like this. Come out and take out all the stops. Come into the supply region. And let's start heading lower. Somewhere like somewhere like so. For AUDUSD. So I believe that's what AUDUSD might do. Um, so I'm just going to be watching. For now, like I said, no trades to place. I'm still holding on to my Euro US dollar trade. The year just started. This is just 18th of February. There's too many trades. Don't rush it. Don't stress yourself. Once again, guys, go ahead and grab your Willis Capital prop account so that you can take advantage of all of this. Um, and yeah, I've got a special message from OctaFX. Um, once again, guys, OctaFX has really supported the channel and obviously kindly listen to what I have to say in the OctaFX video. They've been rocking with us. And if you're looking for a trading account like a normal brokerage account to trade with you can give OctaFX a shot um they've really been supporting us and they seem like the real deal so you can rock with OctaFX for now <laughs> rock with them for now um so yeah once again guys thank you for staying to the very end of this video um listen to what they have to say at OctaFX and i'll catch you guys in my subsequent videos okay i love you guys very much and let's go listen please and take some action. Take it easy and I'll see you guys. Bye. Guys, as you know, OctaFX has been rocking with us for the longest. They've been sponsoring the channel, especially this segment called Trader Talk. So it's only natural for us to give them a quick shout out. Now they do have a message for us and I'm gonna be sharing the message with you guys. So permit me, if you see me, keep looking down. I just wanna ensure that I don't miss anything. Like I said, OctaFX, you guys absolutely rock. So yeah, as you guys know, OctaFX has undergone a rebranding and they're proudly known as Okta. No longer OctaFX. It is now known as Okta. So over the years, obviously Okta has expanded its financial services, offering over 300 trading instruments from commodities to cryptocurrency, so from gold, oil, all the way up to BTC and Ethereum as well. Now the mission is to make trading hassle-free for you guys. Okta ensures industry low spreads, no hidden fees and low commissions. As you know, security is a top priority for Okta, so obviously you guys don't get hacked and all that kind of stuff. Providing negative balance as well, meaning that you are... So what a lot of people don't understand what negative balance simply means. A lot of brokers in the past, um, if you're in a losing trade, they'll literally allow your position going to negative, meaning that they will allow your account balance actually going to negative. But in Okta's case, um, they don't allow that. And believe it or not, there are a lot of people who actually owe brokers money because the brokers just didn't have a negative balance protection. So I really like that feature. And then obviously preventing you from risking more than you invest. So imagine if you invested 5K and then for you know you end up losing 6K. So now you owe the broker 1K. In OctaFX case, that is not the situation. Negative balance protection. And I know why I keep stressing this because I feel it's a really cool future, right? I don't know why all the brokers don't do it. So you ask yourself why Okta? Now Okta provides a seamless platform transition from web to mobile, always allowing you trade anywhere and anytime. 
So on this, you guys, you get the chance to explore risk-free with OctaFX demo account before diving into live trading. So you guys know, as I always preach here, always ensure to demo your strategy first before you jump in. And you, you guys know OctaFX actually, sorry, not OctaFX. <laughs> you couldn't break my head for this part. <laughs> no, it's called Octa. It's no longer OctaFX, it's Octa. Uh, Octa actually does offer a demo trading platform before you, know, you jump into live trading so that you can practice your strategy so you don't go on your live account and actually just now, guys, obviously, there's an exclusive offer. Uh, there's a promo going on, so feel free to use the promo code DAPO100 for a 100% bonus on your deposit, basically turning your $100 deposit into $200. US Now, guys, as always, it's always a friendly reminder, and I always have to, you know, I always feel the need to state this. Trading comes with risk, especially with leverage. It's not for everyone, so only invest money you're comfortable losing. You all know that, and please take this seriously. Once again, get ready to embark on your Okta trading journey. Check the link in the description down below. As always, to so find the link, go ahead and create your account. And don't forget to use the promo code. It's DAPO100. And I'll see you guys on the live trading stuff. Now, guys, once again, let's jump into the video. But guys, for real, rock with Okta effects. They've, they've literally supported the channel, especially Trader Talk. Like, like I was saying to you guys, I, I, I really appreciate them because they actually put in, obviously, Traders First, right? They For the fact that they sponsored this segment of um, the channel, which is Trader Talk, which actually means, which actually shows to me that they're actually interested in the welfare of traders because Trader Talk represents me showing you guys how the market works properly, right? So once again, guys, that's the message from OctaFX. Click the link down below, create your account, double 100 is the promo code. And guys, let's jump into the video. OctaFX is the way to go, guys. Let's go.